Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome once again to our episode on the business plan workbook. So today I'm going to touch on the executive summary of Monakin, the example to using Monakin, which is done for Monande Kingdom. So the self-publishing book industry. So in this case, we're going to look at the mastering the executive summary. I'll give a key less key elements or key components to attract investors. So in 2024, it's the current updated one. So in this case, as I said as uh, already, like in the previous episodes, the name which you're going to use in all the examples is Monakin, which is based on the self-publishing, books self-publishing, the book industry. So should we begin, ladies and gentlemen? Tighten your belt and let's begin, should we? So we said the business name is Monakin. The industry is based on the self-publishing services. Business model, our model is based on the service-based, so it is only service-based. It's not about goods, providing goods, it's all about services, providing services to authors. Then we have the, it is online platform, so that's the business model, service-based online platform. The founder, we have Monande Kindembo, so I'm going to give a full overview, like in-depth overview about the executive summary in the case of a business plan workbook. So the mission, you have to state the mission statement. You have to give a mission statement of your company or your business. So in our case, we're using Monakin. So let's begin. So we look at the mission statement. We look at the vision. We're going to give the business overview. We give the market opportunity. We show the target market, our target market as an online-based, service online-based. We're going to look at the products and services, then the revenue model, we look at the founding requirements, founding requirements, goals and milestones. So we have to set goals and milestones, a clear vision as well. Then we look at the unique value promotion, the UVP, unique value promotion proposition. Then at the end, I'm going to give a quick summary as I usually do in all the videos, just to get the blend really, to get the feeling of the of what we learned really in the, each episode. So let's begin, ladies and gentlemen. Let's begin, ladies and gentlemen. They we're going to look at the mission statement, which is crucial as well. You have to state your mission as well, the mission of your business. So Monakin empowers like aspiring and established authors. So we're focusing on the aspiring and established authors, like by providing comprehensive self-publishing services, like enabling them to transform their ideas and to publish works. So you have got like your idea, you can bring that, then we can publish that, we can transform it and to publish work, like publish works. So in the case, all the ideas inside your head, then once you have the book, you have something tangible, something physical. And the book, like they say, the written words, remain while spoken words fly away. So the vision, when it is written down, you have got some published works. That's the whole concept. So we aim to democratize the publishing industry by offering like affordable, professional support, tailored to each author's unique vision. Because I've got a average range of authors, so each author, each, each individual, individual, we have to expect they've got their own unique vision as well. Then we look at our vision as the self-publisher or ser like a service space, uh, which is the online platform. So our vision is to become the go-to platform for self-published authors worldwide. That's our vision. So like known for our commitment, like to quality like personalized services, good customer care. That's all about personalized services, being there for authors as well. And empowering, like empowering authors of all backgrounds without looking at ethnic, ethnic, like ethnic, ethnic or background or any racism really, like all backgrounds we don't care about. As long as you've got a vision, if you, you know what you're doing, then your vision will be transformed into a published works. Then our business overview about Monakin. So, in this case, we say Monakin is a self-publishing service that offers a full range of professional services. Professional services. Because I've already, I've got experience already. I myself being an author, I myself, I can be good as well as, as self-publishing. Because I've been there, so I know what to expect in the future, really. Uh, as for expiring, aspiring authors. Like including editing, cover editing, like interior formatting like distribution and marketing support as well We're going to offer all of those things all the attributes so we cater to both the new and experienced authors aspiring and established authors like providing them with the tools and the guidance they need to successfully publish and promote their books that is our business overview 
Like by offering a comprehensive suite of services, Monakin aims to remove the barriers to entry in the publishing world, giving authors control over their creative work while ensuring high standards of quality, always emphasizing putting more emphasis on the quality over quantity. Then marketing opportunity, market opportunity, like the self-publishing industry has experienced like significant growth in recent years, driven by digital technology and the changing consumer preferences, like when now in the whole world has been digitalized really. Like more authors are opting to self-publishing to remain creative, like to retain creative control, which is good as well if you're self-published. So you are like you retain your creative control as well. You earn high, uh, high royalties and access global audiences as well in the case of marketing, social medias and all of the things like that. Good for promotion as well. So this shift has created a strong demand for prof professional services that help authors navigate the complexities of publishing. So Monarchin position itself positions itself as a trusted partner in CC space, like catering to the growing number of, all right, of writers who seek to publish, who seek to self-publish, but need support in the areas like editing, cover designing, and marketing as well. Target market, so you have to know you, you targeted audience really, or the, the ones in our case because we are self-publishing, we're simply targeting at the aspiring authors. These are like the individuals looking to publish their first book, the people still lack the experience, the people who don't know what to expect really. We look at the established authors, this is our target market, or audience. Established authors, these are like writers seeking greater control of their work, and high role, role like earnings as well. So in the case of the established authors, they've already known how to publish their first book. They're now seeking for more income or more royalty, like higher royalties. Then the specialized writers, so you have three categories, aspiring authors, established authors, and the specialized writers, authors or writers. So these are like niche content creators in need of a platform that understands their unique needs. So in this case, it is all about customization really and tailoring like tailoring all their work really according to the specialized writers so they are the ones who already knows what they want and what they need so then we're going to look at the products and services in this case it is all about like providing editing services like de developmental editing developmental editing copy editing which simply means book editing and proofreading as well in the case of designing and f and formatting it's like the customer cover design interior formatting like for print and ebooks as well, like the paperback and ebooks or the hard covers. So it depends. The ebook and paperback have to be formatted differently. So in the case of the ebook, you have to consider the device model, like the the formats really, like of the, the device. In it. Like we have got an iPad, we have got a mobile phone device, and things like that. So we have got different screen sizes and pixel maybe. Then we're going to look at the publishing services. So in the case of publishing services, it's like we're still under under the product and services. So if you are offering public uh, publishing services, this like you have to offer the ISBN as well, the international standard book, book number, assignment, ISBN assignment, distribution, like a print on demand. This is optional. Like this is an advanced one, like Amazon, they are all, like and the digital to draft. They're the ones who can offer the print on demand. So if the authors got their books published and they cannot do the print on demand or if they cannot provide the service like printing the book or shipment, all of that, we can decide maybe in the future, in the near future, we can do all of the all advanced uh, options as well. In the case of marketing and promotion, it's like author websites, creating an author website, which would be good for promotion, having their work there uh, or legacy there. So if anyone starts searching for book or any blog according to the author, all the website will be tailored according to their their views as well, or according to their niches, or if they are fiction author, non-fiction, and classical as well. So it depends on the each author, each the demand of each author. So in the social media, this will be like the social social media management is all about marketing and promotion. Maybe do a book launch campaigns as well. That's all book launch campaigns all based on the marketing and promotion as well this is more advanced as well the latter so in the case if we develop as well if we're growing then we can focus more on the book launch uh, campaigns like giving the author or the aspiring author more exposure to the public so we can, we can, we can look at the adv like additional services as well on pr under pro product and services we can add some additional services like doing the audiobook production 
or translation services and workshops as well. All of those can go under the category of uh, additional services. So if an author has published a book, maybe some people, can, it's so hard to discover the book, then you can do an audio book for that. Maybe you can publish that in the public platforms so people can consume audio books. After that, they will come and start buying the book, the paperback or the ebooks as well, which they can read on their phones or mobile devices. Translation as well is good, like translate, translating your work in different languages. But now English is like a global language or marketing language, commerce language, which is known worldwide in this case. But there's still an option really, you can translate your work as well, just to, to reach more audience or to reach more, more people worldwide. Then the, we look at the revenue model. So in the case, Monakin generates a revenue by offering these services on a per project basis, per project basis. So as well as true monthly subscriptions, like for ongoing marketing and digital support services. So we also plan to introduce premium packages and education workshops for authors. So all of those, you can take all of those consideration, like in the near future, really, the more you grow, the more you advance, the more services you keep including as well, because this is a service place based online platform. So on the founding requirements as well, the video just just did recently. So you have to know the founding requirements. This is also crucial in the case of a book, um, business plan, business plan workbook, B founding requirements. You have to tell all of them down. So this is it's like the financial section. So to launch Monakin on a low budget, you have to focus on low budget plan. So we estimate a total first year cost of 6,249 euros, like covering essential expenses such as business registration, website development, marketing, and professional services as well, under all of the, under the low budget plan, 6,249 euros. So after that, you have to consider about the initial funding. So initial funding will be secured through personal investment and the potential small businesses loans or grants. So you can get grants, maybe some loans as well. So it depends if your business plan is well, if your business plan workbook is appealing, then you might get grants as well, like in different institutions. Maybe you might get loans from the bank or financial support. Then we look at the goals and milestone. So in the case of a business, you need to set goals, realistic goals, the smart, the goals have to be realistic, which can be achievable as well. And you have to set the time, so all of those things. So and milestones as well, like we say in the first year, like establish the business, acquire the first 25 clients and achieve break even uh, by the end of the year. So in the case of break even, so we're talking, we're talking about under the financial plan. So break even is simply based on the like the fixed and variable costs, which meant to determine the number of units needed to sell to cover expenses. That's the all about the break even. So in the first year, we're aiming like to establish the business, acquire the first twenty five clients in the first year, and achieve break even by the end of the year. So we want to cover the expenses at the end of the year, or all the expenditures really. Then at the as year two or second year, like expand the service offerings in the case of advancement, so we can advance our service as well. Like the key ones, which I say in the print on demand, like in second year, we can do that on the book launch campaigns as well. We can include that in the second year, like expand services offerings, double client based, and introduce premium packages as well. So, all of those can go like in maybe in additional services, like audio production, translation, and workshops. Then the year two, at the end of year two as well, we can like become a recognized brand in the self-publishing industry, reaching a total revenue of 1,000K or 1,000 euros. So that is like the goal which you set, a milestone. So at the end of the year, you want to reach maybe a revenue of 1,000 1, euros or 1,000 euro or 100K euros. Then we're going to look at the UV, UVP, Unique Value Pro Proposition. Like Monakin offers a, a one-stop solution for self-published authors combining the best of traditional publishing standards with the flexibility and accessibility of digital platforms. So our personalized approach ensures that each author's unique voice is heard and celebrated. That's the key term there, like each author's voice is heard and celebrated. So after the promotion, after reaching the correct audience, then the author also will feel more proud in, in himself or herself. Then what can we say in summary after going there at through the business executive really like trying to master the executive executive summary and while well, I give you the key elements to attract investors in 2024. So in the case of attracting investors, it is all about having a good business plan workbook, which is tailored to your business and you give 
specific details which are tailored according to you. This is what investors are looking for or stakeholders. Or if you want loan or bus uh, business financial aid, you need to have a business book plan as well. So there's no loan, bank loan or there's no investors helping you or any grants without having a business plan. So business plan is there really to show, to show that you've got the ability to start your own business. And once you've got the ability, maybe they'll give, they'll give you the opportunity as well to, to go ahead, start up. Then summary is uh, Monakin is posed to meet the growing demand for professional self-publishing services. Like with a clear vision, you need to have a vision with a clear vision, a well-defined target market, and a comprehensive range of offerings, we are confident in our ability to build a successful and impactful business that helps authors achieve their publishing dreams. So by being self-published author or self-publishing industry, you want really to bring all the authors, aspiring authors, established authors, and the last one, specialized writers or authors, you want to bring them together and make them achieve their dreams or tailor it, customize to their own vision or needs. That's all. Ladies and gentlemen, just as we start, thank you so much for listening. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share the video to friends and uh, anyone who's in need of a business plan, workbook, or anyone who needs guidance, really. I know everyone's this age. Well, if maybe this is the age of Aquarius. So it is all about information, and you have to not use the information in the correct direction. So thanks so much for watching. Ciao, bye.